Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to use the Theme Authenticity Checker or the TAC plugin for WordPress themes. And now obviously when people first start up their, new, their brand new site, uh, if you're a bit hard up for cash you want to use a free WordPress theme and why not? There are many many fantastic free WordPress themes available but of course you have to be careful where you get them, get them from there are occasions when either the author the coder of the theme or the site that's giving the theme theme away for free will add links or malicious code within the blog to help their own website uh, now while I fully agree that a, a coder of a theme the author of a theme should be allowed to add a link or two to every theme that he creates especially if he's giving it away for free it is not okay to add malicious dangerous code to themes that people are basing their business websites around so first off if you are going to be looking at a free WordPress theme uh, my first advice would be to get it directly through the WordPress website itself the official WordPress site do not log into do not Google free WordPress themes for example because most of those that come up at the top of the page uh, will have themes on their site that are that contain dodgy code um, saying that okay let's say you've downloaded the themes that you like you've seen some themes that look like just what you're looking for you've downloaded them and you want to know what code what links are contained within that theme so to do that you can use a, a, a fantastic little plugin for WordPress called TAC theme authenticity checker and what we'll do we'll go into plugins add new here and basically we will just type in TAC as in said before because I do all my sites my themes and here we go I don't have it installed at the moment very popular I'm gonna install it straight away because I've used it many times on many sites that I've used uh, whenever I use a free WordPress theme or a premium WordPress theme for that matter I want to see what links or code is involved in it so I'm gonna activate it here we go we're going to under appearance and we click on the TAC link it will automatically check every theme that we have downloaded onto our or uploaded I should say onto our WordPress site and uh, not just the one that's activated it will check all of them for malicious uh, or potentially unwanted code okay so the first two obviously are the ones I'm using Genesis and lifestyle theme for Genesis by Studio Press I would expect them to have no links and no code because these are premium these are ones I've paid for and that they are excellent um, very versatile themes to use um, pros I have on as well all Genesis themes they shouldn't have code okay 2010 the standard WordPress theme one is okay uh, and that's it that's obviously all I've got on this on this uh, neilmax.com blog uh, if you have links it will say it here I should have done it with the uh, themes that have links and code in it to show you um, but obviously I don't really want to upload them to my site it will show you the links here uh, having one or two links it will still be green it will tell you the links are there but it's not dangerous it's it's accepted if you have a free WordPress theme that the coder should be allowed to do that if it's red however and it says uh, code base 64 code you can actually open it and check out the code that's uh, of it, that's inside your theme if it's red and you get the malicious base 64 code involved in your site delete it have nothing to do with it you do not want that on your site okay so I would advise anyone who's downloading or uploading free WordPress themes to their site to check out the TAC plugin to quickly run the rule over your free sites make sure they're free of malicious code once you've done it you can disable TAC and you can go on uh, with creating your site okay that's uh, this is Neil Max hope you've enjoyed that little snippet I'll see you in the next video